First, let's understand what's music. Music is a, a certain arrangement of sounds. If you arrange sounds in a certain way, it will become noise. If you arrange sounds in a different way, it will become music. There's whole lot of noise passing as music right now, okay? If you know something about classical music, you would see classical music involves an enormous amount of mathematic behind it. There's a structure, a mathematical structure is being built. As far as I'm concerned, when I see somebody really good singing, for me, a whole geometry emerges out of that. So, in some way, you're trying to recreate creation in a sound form. How profoundly a particular musician, how far he can go into it is questionable. But that's what you're trying to do, you're trying to explore the geometrical patterns, all the complex patterns that are possible in the form of creation. Because creation is just a complex amalgamation of sounds or reverberations. So, you definitely know, leave the words, I mean, if there are sappy words and people get, l you know, uh, a little sappy with it, that's different, they're giving meanings to it. Without any words, music can bring tears, music can bring joy, music can bring love, music can set moods and emotions and experiences in people, just by sheer sound, not using words. Words means it's a psychological pattern. Sound means it's an existen existential pattern. So this is why a music without words is very significant and most of the Indian music is largely sound, here and there some words, but largely sound because sound is an exist existential structure. Word, the meaning of the word, is a psychological structure. If I uh, say, if I sing a song in Tamil, means nothing to you because you may not understand the language. If you sing in some other language that I do not know, means nothing to me because I do not understand the meaning. But the nature of the sound is not like that. If the sound is arranged in a, a particular geometry of things, it doesn't matter who you are, it doesn't get you in your emotion, but it gets you in the very being of who you are in the basic way this… this creation has happened here. So it is an attempt to touch life. It's an attempt to imitate life in a different form, which is a phenomenal thing. And will people get healthy and well by this? Definitely, if you hit the right pitch.